Greetings and salutations. Grace unto you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. This is Wesley Webb, pastor of the Grace Baptist Church in Greater Downtown Metropolitan, Matby, South Carolina, and welcome to the Higher Grounds Podcast and today's Morning Minute Meditation. I'm interested today in Matthew chapter 7, verse 3, 4, and 5, where the Bible said, And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye, but considerest not the beam that is in thine own eye? Or how wilt thou say to thy brother, Let me pull out the mote out of thine eye, and behold, a beam is in thine own eye? Thou hypocrite, first cast out the beam out of thine own eye, and then thou shalt see clearly to cast the mote out of thy brother's eye. Luke said it this way in chapter 6, verse 41 and 2, And why beholdest thou the mote that is in thy brother's eye, but perceivest not the beam uh, that is in thine own eye? Either how canst thou say to thy brother, Brother, let me pull out the mote that is in thine eye, when thou beholdest not the beam that is in thine own eye. Thou hypocrite, cast out first the beam out of thine own eye, and then thou shalt see clearly to pull out the mote that is in thy brother's eye. Now what is all this mote beam business? Well, mote, Strong's Concordance, it's just a dry twig or straw. And a beam, Strong's Concordance, it's the idea of holding up, and it's a stick of timber. It's a beam, like like would hold up a, a a pillar would hold up part of a building. It's the difference between a splinter and a railroad tie. It's the difference between a stick and a beam of lumber that is a pillar of the building. Jesus said it was hypocritical to point out the moat in the lives of others when you haven't even addressed the beam in your own life. Isn't it interesting that critical is a part of Hypocritical, hypo, hypo, critical, hypo, it's a prefix meaning under or less than normal, and critical meaning inclined to criticize severely or unfavorably. So the hypocrite in our text verses is quick to be critical of the moat in a brother's eye, but they offer less than normal criticism for themselves, even though their problem is much bigger. So what's the lesson for us to learn here? Well, simply this. When you start picking out or when you start picking at the little things in the lives of brothers, it's a sure sign that you've got big problems of your own that need dealing with. Well, that's all for today's Morning Minute Meditation. Y'all have a great day. And remember, it is what it is.